Welcome to your daily devotional, My Life Today, December, and Eternal Life. December 15th, we shall recognize each other. Now I know in part, but then I shall know even as also I am known. 1 Corinthians 13 verse 12 In the mentions above, we shall meet to part no more. We shall know each other in our heavenly home. The redeemed will meet and recognize those whose attention they have directed to the uplifted Savior. What blessed converse they have with these souls. I was a sinner, it will be said without God and without hope in the world, and you came to me and drew my attention to the precious Savior as my only hope. Others will say, I was a heathen in heathen lands. You left your friends and comfortable home and came to teach me how to find Jesus and believe in him as the only true God. I demolished my idols and worshipped God, and now I see him face to face. I am saved, eternally saved, ever to behold him whom I love. Others will express their gratitude to those who fed the hungry and clothed the naked. When despair bound my soul in unbelief, the Lord sent you to me to the Lord sent you to me, they say, to speak words of hope and comfort. You brought me food for my physical necessities, and you opened to me the word of God, awakening me to my spiritual needs. You treated me as a brother. You sympathized with me in my sorrows and restored my bruised and wounded soul so that I could grasp the hand of Christ that was reached out to save me. In my ignorance, you taught me patiently that I had a Father in heaven who cared for me. You read to me the precious promises of God's word. You inspired in me the faith that he would save me. My heart was softened subdued, broken, as I contemplated the sacrifice which Christ had made for me. I am here, saved, eternally saved, ever to live in his presence and to praise him who gave his life for me. What rejoicing there will be as these redeemed ones meet and greet those who have had a burden in their behalf. And those who have lived, not to please themselves, but to be a blessing to the unfortunate who have so few blessings, how their hearts will thrill with satisfaction. An Eternal Life, December 15th